Can I take just a moment of your time? I come to you at this particular night by the mercies of our God. It is time that we take time out and to just listen to God and his word. And I have a question. Because oft time when there are some preachers that preach, they say often to a person that you're going to hell. And my question is, being that they're so convinced and that they're so sure that you're going to hell, my question is, I wonder just where they're going. When Paul writes to the Corinthians in 1 Corinthians, the 4th chapter, it reminds me of a certain carefulness that is involved when it comes to preaching God holy and divine word. We must be careful because God's word imposes his judgment upon us as well, even as ministers. He said to the Corinthians, let a man so account of us as the ministers of Christ and stewards of the mysteries of God. Moreover, it is required in stewards that a man be found faithful. There's a certain faithfulness that is involved, that we must be faithful even of those that are within and those that are without. People should understand that we are servants of the Lord as well. That being a Christian, it doesn't make us to be a God over anyone. It doesn't make us to be better than someone else. But Paul, when he goes on to write, he said, but with me, it is a very small thing that I should be judged of you or a man's judgment. Yea, I judge not mine own self. For I know nothing by myself, yet as I am not hereby justified, but he that judgeth me is the Lord. Therefore, judge nothing before the time until the Lord come. I say to those of you who are ministers today, be careful what you say in the hearts of people, because we shall stand before God's judgment as well, and we must be judged by him. So therefore, judge nothing before the time until the Lord come. And when he comes, he will be judge of all men. God bless you and God keep you here tonight.